You know, most little boys grow up wanting to be like firemen or policemen or baseball players. Not me. I wanted to be a dentist and it happened at a really early age. We had such a great dentist that I actually was intrigued and he helped me so much that I thought, you know, this is a really great profession. This is something I really want to do when I grow up and that's kind of how I decided to be a dentist. I've been practicing dentistry now for 30 years and um, when I first started and, and I wanted to build that practice, you know, marketing was a lot different than it is today. Uh, we did print ads, uh, we went out into Century City and actually passed out flyers and we built our practice and then as those people came in and we went from external marketing to internal marketing, it just grew and grew and grew. So everything has changed, you know? And then you have to look at Yelp, and you have to look at Pinterest, and you have to look at Twitter and Instagram and all. None of these things were around when I started practicing, but they all matter today. So, you know, what I tell dentists is either become an expert in it or have somebody in your office that's an expert in it or hire somebody. But to ignore it and think that you can have a thriving dental practice today without it is just a fallacy. You know, what a lot of dentists don't get is really simple. Image is everything. It's everything. What people see when they first walk in your office, their perception of what you are and what you do really relies on the appearance of your office, the appearance of, of your employees, how they're treated. I mean, every little thing. You walk into a dental office and you see cars or sailboats on the wall. I don't sell sailboats. I sell smiles. When you look on my walls, you see beautiful smiling faces. Why? Because that's what I sell. When you walk into a dental office and you're doing cosmetic dentistry, you should see beautiful smiles. And when your patients are sitting in your reception area waiting, why should they watch the news? They should watch dental information. I mean, it's a free marketing opportunity. So Smile Vision TV enables me to educate my patients, teach them about my practice, teach them about dentistry, show them procedures and things that they probably wouldn't know about. And you know, it, it's kind of just a golden opportunity to take advantage of. I, I don't know why any dentist wouldn't do it, honestly. I mean. It doesn't even matter what it costs, I would pay it, but the fact that it's so inexpensive also makes me say, why don't you do this? And it's not just about the dentistry, you're creating an experience, and the experience has to be great.